What the f Did you not look in the damn rooms? <laughs> All right, y'all. It has been almost a whole, a whole goddamn year since the last Fierce to Fathom game. I played all four of the last episodes back to back to back a year ago, almost a year ago. It's crazy how fast time flies, but we are finally back with another episode. Episode five of Fierce to Fathom Woodbury Getaway. So I don't know how this is going to go for me. So I had to bring I had to bring my, my twins out. You know, I, I don't know if y'all knew, but I'm actually a triplet. I'm actually a triplet, man. It's weird, though. We're all different sizes, and we all talk at the same time. But listen, bro. I had to bring some help. I had to bring gang in them. Because if I need to fight somebody like I almost had to do in the last game, bro, I'm going to need some backup this time. Man, if y'all if y'all are new to the channel, I know a lot of y'all are going to be... If y'all are new to the channel, I got a playlist in the comment in the comment section and the description of the other four games. Uh, Cause we played all four of them. Did we beat all four of them? That is that is for you to find out. <laughs> but man, I am. I didn't even know this game was coming out. I see. I saw the usuals post their their games. I was like, oh yeah, yeah, it, it's time. It's time for another scary game, bruh. Um, yeah, man. Let's get this intro done with, bruh. If you're new to the channel, you know what to do. Sub up. Uh, I'll be honest, bro. I would like to say, if you got any more scary games like this that you want me to play, it's October's coming up, so I'm, we might as well load up some scary games anyways. So look, without further ado, bruh, let's get to it, man. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a subside the, the, the twins for a little bit, but if, if they got to come out, I'm gonna let y'all, I'm gonna let y'all know. Let's get to the game. <laughs> oh boy. Eat the coffee to get done with the day. I don't know what voice we're giving them. Let me check my emails real quick. Rainbow sheets. Oh lord. Alright. This what is this the finances of of said company that I said work for said? Oh, Roth Capital. Alright, this is all. Hey, I wonder. Oh fuck. Type invader. I'm about to expose the shit out of myself. Hold on. Oh shit. Oh shit, I'm about to explode this explode. Expose the shit out of myself. What the fuck is score most? What the fuck? Pull? Bro? What the fuck is a score most? Lord Jesus. Decimal. Okay, hold on, it's not that bad. It is it, it's, it's not good either. Ring press. Okay, I should be. Oh, oh subtract. Uh, group. I'm panicking. I shouldn't be looking at my keyboard, but I'm looking at it. I'm exposing myself. All right. I didn't think that this is what I'd be doing yet. Dog. Rest in peace. Accuracy 94%. Hold on. What does that say? Nine busy? What the hell does that mean? Let me try it without looking. There's one behind you. What the hell? What? What? Why are these words so? Why are these words so long? Pause. Nothing came. Oh Jesus Christ! That's a long ass word, bro. All right, hold on. Oh, this looks. Oh boy. Oh, we got some life, life to the city now. Bruh, first of all, why can't I just, you know, have more light? Why, why I gotta sit here with this damn lamp on? And why am I the only one here? Bruh. Note to self, man. Take time off. When you need time off, 
take it, bruh. I'm taking time off right now. What I I need coffee, right? Somebody else here. All right, cool. That's that's good. That's good. I'm gonna go throw some chips at him. A coffee. Needed to prepare the cup of coffee. Uh huh. We got a little cure egg. Needed water. Okay. We done? Sip, oh, sip, sip, sip. My hands are full. You don't want to sip on your coffee? Hey! I'm about to eat somebody lunch. This should look good as hell. How you get that whole pizza in the microwave? Sip on your coffee, bro. <laughs> what if I just throw it? Wait, what the hell was that cutscene for? Need to put a lid on. Where the damn lids at? You need a straw too? Get that out of my face. Stir it up, right? Okay. Ooh. Straight out the hot, hot, hot stove, huh? Now you... One of those, huh? You drink coffee and it go right through you, huh? Let me go talk to talk to Ted over here. Yo, Ted. I didn't know you were still in. Bruh, if there's a damn ghost... Oh. I was about to say... Yo, Ted. What do you want, Sid? I'm trying to get this done. Can can you like be a little nicer? I was just checking checking if you needed anything. Can't these clients ever make up their minds? Still working on that report. Yeah, I'm trying to get this done. Don't burn yourself out, man. Whatever. Da 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 da. Bro, this is so depressing. Oh, there's the restroom. Just finish your coffee, bro. You gonna take this with you? What if I just do this at him? It won't let me. I, I, I so wanted to see if I could be a little disrespectful today. You just gonna take your coffee with you in the restroom? All right, what's gonna jump out at me? We know, we know, we know the fears to fathom MO, bro. Somebody's hiding somewhere, and somebody's about to jump out at me, bro. I already know it. I'm, I'm bracing myself. Wait, my name is Sid. Am I a girl or a guy? Wait, I might be a girl. Oh, I'm a female. Sid is a, uh, what's the word? Uh, what's the word for um? girl and guy name what kind of setup it's a lot of sinks check them all Ooh, drinking on the toilet that's not good for your health couldn't do it with the door wide open I mean What's that other dude's name? I'm just, I'm bracing myself up. This is a damn women's bathroom. And that sounded like a manly hum. Bracing. I still got the coffee in my hand. 
I need to piss again. Bro, throw this shit. Brace yourself. It's gonna be loud. Oh, there we go. Yeah, trick. It's a janitor. Why are you doing that, bro? That's weird. Whoa, well, ma'am, sorry. Didn't know anyone was in here. Did you not hear me pissing? Almost gave me a heart attack. I gotta give her a new a new voice now. I'm so sorry. It should have should have knocked before. Yeah, you should have. It's the damn women's bathroom, you dumb fuck. I came in, but there isn't. It, yeah. No, it's fine. You're just doing a job. Yes, you should have knocked. I'm about to be a Karen. Again, I'm sorry. I usually do not, but I'm a little bit frustrated to not. Must have must have slipped my mind. What is you so frustrated? <laughs> Someone keeps. Someone keeps throwing coffee cups on the floor all over the office. Uh, it's been it's been happening for weeks. Uh, <laughs> well, yeah, that's that's. That's really rude. <laughs> well, I need to get back back to it. Don't want you uh, to be here all night picking up coffee cups. Now have a great night. You still here? What if my pants was down? Can I wash my hands? Where the soap at? Let me just... Just like... Creepy ass dude. 69 God. Sorry. I'm a little bit more unsettled because the last female we played as uh, had some creepy ass dudes in that bitch. I remember the, the hotel one. The hitchhiker one. Answer this damn phone. Uh, wait. Oh, my 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 name is Sydney. Go for Sydney Harper. Hey, Harp, it's Mike. Hey, Mike. I've been trying to call yourself for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Is everything all right? My battery dies at the worst times. Oh snap! I was starting to think maybe you were ignoring me. <laughs> uh. Hell yeah, I'm ignoring you. You creepy ass dude with the creepy ass laugh. No, it, it even cut out on a client earlier. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, uh, anyway, uh, what are you still doing at work? It's getting kind of late. My work has been more, it's overwhelming lately. Damn, Harp, that sounds rough. Good thing I called to cheer you up. Um, about our trip, did you get a chance to book the rental house? Just really wanted to see you. And Nora. Hell no. Nah. You seem a bit annoyed about me calling. Seriously, Harper, this is a bad time. I only get two options for my, my answers, and I'm sorry if I sound weird. Mike, come on, I'll do it now. That's the Sydney Harper I know. I'm sorry if I was being pushy. I'm, I'm just struggling a little bit lately. No worries, Harper. I don't want to stress you out. As long as you book it tonight, I think it'll be fine. Why don't you book it? You you sound like you're free and you off work, bitch. Sorry. Hey. <laughs> Yeah. I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride together. It'd be nice to catch up. Wait, are you like dating me or are you not dating me? I'm I'm confused. That, that was my thoughts. I was thinking that. <clears throat> you know, save on gas and relive the good old days. Just a little bit of Mike and Sydney time before Nora gets there. Sounds good. Great. Uh, I guess I'll let you get back to work then. Oh, uh, wait, one more thing. What? When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under $100 a night. Why, are you broke? 
Nora and I were talking and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her. Who the hell is Nora and why are you talking to me? Sure, I'll find something affordable. It'll be just like the old college days. You always had a knack for finding the best spots. I should really, I should really make the booking now. Right, right, of course. Sorry for yapping. I'm just excited, I guess. Okay. All right, talk to you later, Harp. Click, bitch! <laughs> um. Is this a damn love triangle? <laughs> what am I searching for? Am I doing it? Am, what am I doing? Uh, hotel. <laughs> I'm glad that y'all typed it for me because I definitely was about to type some random shit. <laughs> Fuck it, hit my cord. My fault. Uh, find find your place to stay. Rent a, in a cabin from hosting her. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! We'll bury. Damn, 350, 249. What if I like go above the budget? Who's paying for this? All right. Private cabin. This isn't a cabin though. I feel a little lied to. That ain't no damn cabin. All right. Entire home flat. Two reviews for three stars. That ain't a good ratio, man. Oh, but that's worse. That's the one. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I'm big on reviews, bro. Look at this one. <laughs> Cozy Lodge Woodbury. 34 reviews, all five stars. Come on, man. You get what you pay for. That's what they say, bro. When you get the cheapest one, that means the serial killer has already tried to break in. And them locks is already broken. Right. If I die, it's your fault. I'm going to write it out. Your booking has been confirmed. So I just paid for it. Wait. Wait. Y'all better be paying me back. I'm assuming you get hundreds, if not thousands of stories sent. Oh, oh, so I. I give you I give you a basic rundown of something that happened to me. I'm sorry if some of, of it is written weird, but I was rushed. You didn't try Grammarly. Not sponsored. When I was in my early 20s, I worked at a big consulting firm in my city. I should be reading this, I said, but I ain't doing that. <sighs> Life at the firm was constant a juggling, <laughs> a constant juggle of deadlines, client meetings, and trying to prove my worth, which didn't leave much room for leisure, let alone a social life. The job paid well, sure, but at the expense of my mental peace. I'm Sydney Harper, and this story takes place during one of those days. One of my college friends, Mike, suggested that we take a weekend getaway to rural, rural Vermont, which sounded like a perfect break from cycle of work. And my other friend, Nora, was quick to jump on board as well. So, so, so Mike ain't even dating Nora. Why are you talking like, yeah, bro. See, Mike, like Sydney, right? But see, Nora likes Sydney. I'm going for a twist here. There's a love triangle. My fault. The plan was simple. We rent a small cabin. That ain't small. Close, close our shift early on Friday. Leave and be back on Monday. How far do y'all live from Vermont? Y'all driving there? It's, it's cold too. Y'all got snow tires. 
Mike came to pick me up. Two days? Two days earlier. Later. I, I, I'm sorry. I'm terrible. Is this Mike? Is that a PSP? Why are you smiling like that? I, I would be smiling too if I had a PSP. Uh. It says hang up. Answer the phone. Who the fuck is this? Answer the phone. Why am I hanging up? Why am I hanging up, bruh? Going into the parking garage now. You down? Exit. Why did I why did I hang up? Okay, uh uh wait. Just booked! Do you ever answer the phone? God damn it, bruh. The, the time doesn't stop while I'm reading my messages. I'm off now or I work now. Okay, I'm headed that way. Pulling in the parking garage now. You downstairs yet? Yeah, hell yeah. Uh Hey bro, remember that creepy dude with the PSP's face, bro? Why was he smiling like that? You good, bro? Hug. Uh, what you You nervous? That's still how you hug people? What you mean? Why don't you hug me like you miss me? Bitch Just a test to, to hug to see if you smelled first. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. You look, bruh, stop coming on to me, bruh. Thanks for picking me up. Wouldn't have it any other way. Uh, it'll be nice. I forgot what your voice sounded like, bruh. I can't mimic it. To have company on the way. This old truck brings back so many memories. The front seat, the back seat. With Nora. Right, this bad boy has been through a lot. You could just throw your, your stuff in the back and we'll get on our way. Oh, my shit in the back. Where did my shit go? said throw it Kobe all right then Hart are you ready to hit the road where's Nora she'll meet us there the route through the city would have been a detour for her anyway all right then Hart Tensing up. <laughs> it's too early for a jump scare, even though they already tried to, tried it with the damn janitor. Who the hell is that? It's starting to snow. Oh. It was starting to snow. This was actually a gift from my coworker, Ricky. Said he found it at a garage sale, and it reminded him of me somehow. Where your cowboy hat then, sir? I can see a little, I can see a little bit of resemblance. Almost broke heritage. It's the cowboy spirit, I guess. Yeah, I gave you the cowboy voice for a reason. Hey, bruh. It's a stick shift now. I better see you shifting that. Pause. Hold on, I gotta look out. Should be happening on the road. Heart. Isn't it weird? We used to dream about escaping our college, and now here we are. Trying to escape from the life we wanted to live. Hey, Brad, that's called being an adult, unfortunately. We we couldn't wait to get out, uh, out the real world. Hold on, sir. I got a message. Maybe we just didn't know how much we the, the real world would, would how much the real world would, you know. Ah, uh, what school bus? 
Did you see that school bus? See what? There was a school bus. A school bus back there by the old house. What's, what's wrong with that? Maybe it's a project. You know, someone's idea of turning it into a tiny home on wheels or something. I've read people who do that on the internet. Also, some people park their school buses at their houses. By the way. Oh, snap. That was that was close. You know, I read on the Internet that in Native American lore, seeing a deer cross your path is like getting a message from the universe. Hey, bro, I got that from uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. How many of y'all got that that ending? Who got the who got the who got the who got the deer ending? Let me know, man. Bitch, where the music at? Shift. Sorry. <laughs> How far is it now? Should be about an hour and a half from now. From here, bro. Get you some sleep. You know, driving through the snow kind of feels like we're traveling through the, the, the intergalactic space. No, it feels like you're hydroplaning all over the place. What do you mean? Look at the way the snowflakes swirl around the headlights. It's like stars and galaxies rushing past us. Oh, this dude's a space cowboy. He's been playing. He's been playing Red Dead. And I'm blanking on the other one. The newest one. Made by Bethesda. I'm blanking on the name. I'm I'm forgetting names. I'm forgetting names, bro. What's the newest space game by Bethesda? I played it three times and I don't remember the goddamn name. It's kind of beautiful. Don't distract me from the horrors that await us. By 15 p.m. What time was it then? What the hell kind of time zone? Dairy Mary? Yo heart, well, check check that out. Creepy ass van? Most pizza, I'm pretty sure they win another game, huh? Oh you hungry bitch? Sorry. <laughs> you know, heart, I gotta tell you, these new GPS systems are something else. Bitch, are you lost? This pizzeria is exactly where it appeared on my Jeep. Did they say what damn year it was? Cause it's like living in the future. I'm so hungry. I think I could eat a whole piece of myself. Me too. All right then, Hart. Operation Pizza Pit Stop. It is a go. Prepare to land. Corny ass. Hey, bro, you better be paying for the pizza. I don't already pay for the goddamn room. Hold on, let me check my messages, bro. It's nearly 5 p.m. and I haven't received a confirmation text. I just wanted to check in and make sure everything is okay. The roads near Woodbury can be a little dangerous. We're on our way and should be there around 6 p.m. Uh, the snow. Sh I'm, w I'm looking at my text, damn it. My fault. <laughs> My fault, my bad. That's a that's that's a little uncourteous of me. Come on in, Hart. Thank you. I almost sneezed. Dogs purchased from our dealership are certified pure bread and butter inbreed diamond great hounds. Note, all dogs are tested for influenza and they may not carry multiple military grade. What the hell is your issue? This just in. Reports of a strong snowstorm. Why are you just going to random people's tables? Damn, y'all are y'all are chowing down in that Papa John's. Let's check in with our field. I'd be doing the same, bro. The out there, Phil? I'm, I'm, I'm a, so I'm a huge out piece out of addict. I can't feel my hands, okay? Like, the studio should have really brought some snow gear instead of buying that new coffee machine. I'm sure you'll be fine. You can have some coffee when you get back to the studio. Jerry, you cannot be serious. You know my doctor said not to drink any caffeine. Sounds like someone's we gonna, we gonna a look in the We gonna look Maybe at the credits and see who's voicing cool these people. Here for six years, hey, a black man. Never gets a report somewhere What's up, black man? I'm just clearly the better you good? 
you can worry about where you'll report. Damn, man. You can also this piece of that good? They got cracking that shit. Everybody got a whole box. Shit must be good, bro. All right. Bruh! Rude ass! Oh my god. Come on, bruh. Let's get my. Uh, evening, folks. Looks like the codes got everyone crave a piece of the night. Hell yeah, it's warm and, and greasy and makes you sleepy. You five folks know what you want to eat? A pizza. We'll get. We'll get three slices each. I'll go with pepperoni, cheese, and a veggie. And for you, miss, the most special. They about to put their foot in that shit. All right, what's the second slice? Let me get a pe pepperoni. And the third? Let me get a margarita. Any drinks for you folks? Oh, I forgot to do her voice. That should be all. Cover us. That. Jesus Christ. Just the pieces of their things. Can you tell this man to stop walking through us, bro? This shit is weird. I'm sorry for yelling. All right, then. Uh, I'm mixing up y'all voices. Six hot slices coming up right up. That'll be 20. Damn, that's. I thought y'all had ghosts, bro. Oh, of course. Oh, snap. I left my wallet in the car. Do you have cash, Harper? Bitch, your car is right there, bitch. I done paid $100 for three nights, man. Yo, see, like, I got to, like, move my... I got to move some shit from my savings real quick. I got just got to move some shit around real quick. You mind holding for a little bit, bro? Just a second. Just a slight second. Let me, let me, let me, um, EBT? No? Alright. I'll fall, bro. I did just hit up Chase Bank. <laughs> Your order is 27. Just grab a seat and we'll, cat, we'll call you up when your piece is ready. Did we say yes to drinks? Most special. Wait a minute. Why the hell is the most special? Move! Oh my god, bruh. Y'all some rude ass motherfuckers in this goddamn town. Vermont? I ain't coming to Vermont. Wait, actually. I think I see the picture of Vermont. And how it's like in the fall. It's like beautiful as hell. Because like all the trees are, are like different colors. But also like the buildings are like I ain't gonna lie, bro. I gotta go watch some TV. I'll be back, bro. I gotta see who's on the TV. It's proven that employees who get along well work better together. Tomorrow mm. you'll be the happiest people in the world. This company will have my death point. Month, we'll be redistributing the teams. Fun. We're gonna be one big family, Mark. Bitch! <laughs> I was like, why did I get closer to the damn TV? What is your issue? Why are you talking to random people, bro? They don't want to talk to you, bro. How you doing, my friend? Bitch, I ain't your friend. I'm pretty hungry. Pizza does set, smell awfully good. Bitch, are you gonna get? You gonna get some? Are you going to grab a slice? No, just looking for a little help. Good luck! <laughs> what the fuck? You ain't getting help from me, goddamn stranger. Dead lighters. Net cap. Sounds pretty good. 
Oh, uh, see, I remember this this little little animation. He's stealing! He's stealing! He's stealing! He's stealing! Go get him, bruh! He's stealing, bruh! He's stealing! Damn, you don't know what's up, bruh? I feel like a damn iPad kid. Hey, it's kinda. I remember seeing some like commercials like this before in the back in the day, you know what I'm saying? Hey, you gotta admire this though. You gotta admire this. Not only did they animate a game, but they animated commercials. Dr. Fizz. Get a Dr. Fizz. Wait, there's a Fizz and then a Dr. Fizz. Get a Dr. Fizz. Eighty-five cents. Oh yeah, this is a good old days, huh? Wait, no. Give me my drink. I might need this later, actually. I thought somebody was talking to me. Oops. You know what, bruh? Mountain Pew. I'm just, I'm just stacking up. You know what I'm saying? You mean to tell me that all the other drinks? I just, I just. So like, I thought that like I was getting the drinks, right? I just wasted them uh, 85 cents. So like in dollars, right? That's like. All right, bro. You you want to talk about something? Because you keep looking at me weird. Long sniff. She just snorted some coke. It smells. It smells. It smells so good in here. I couldn't figure out the voice. I ain't doing that long sniff. Oh. I thought that was a wanted poster. Friends three ever. I'm so sorry, guys. Uh. Hold on, hold on. You, you're speaking too fast. you speaking too fast, fam. Uh. Where we at, bro? Don't say cheap, harpy. It makes me sound, well, cheap. We know you're a millionaire at heart, Nora. Uh, the fancy is woman. Hey, this this dude got two females with him, huh? We're on the road, Nora. Let us know when you get going. Okay. Oh, you guys are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as soon as I can. But something last minute popped up. I'm not gonna bore you with all of the details. Well, oh, I hate this the long voice. And short of it is, one of my clients needs a last minute change. Their payments are about the only thing keeping the lights on. I hate to leave so late, but I gotta keep them happy. I'll have this logo done before you know it and be on my way. Hey, I, I gotta mimic that voice. I can't do it, bruh. I can't, I can't, I can't do it. Ugh! I'm, I'm so sorry, you guys. Is that close? Nora! Nora! Please be careful. I hate that you're leaving so late. Drive slow. Don't worry. I'll make sure Harp stays up. What do you mean by that, Michael? What the hell do you mean by that? That's some weird shit. You insinuating something, and I don't like it. I could go I could go three ways, bro. I can go three ways. Did you not just hear me? I ain't got no headphones, bruh. It's goddamn 1987 or some shit, bruh. Did you listen to Nora's voice message in the group? Yeah, I just saw. I saw it, but I ain't listen. That's what she just said. This dude, short as hell. Sorry. <laughs> Looks like she'll be late. That's a bummer. I guess we'll, we'll have to start the fun without her. What can we do? Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking. What the hell do you, you, bro? You sounding creepy, bro. You better be talking about. The Damn, y'all smacking a lot of shit. My fault. Order number set twenty-seven. You folks are right here. 
Damn, bro. I was about to say, bro. You gonna make me pay? You gonna make me pay for the damn shit? You gonna make me pay for the pizza? You, you gonna at least pick it up? You ain't gonna bring my pizza? You just gonna look at me while you? Oh boy. You ain't no damn gentleman. All right, you folks. Are all set? Thank you. Bro, where your where your manners, bro? I should leave you right here and take your damn truck. Now, why you got four slices? That man got four slices, and I got three. He gave you an extra one. Fuck that dude. Sorry. Hey, that look kind of good, bro. This piece of slaps. I feel like that's a. Never mind. It's like. Never mind. Never mind. I ain't gonna date myself. Age myself. Whatever the word is. Can't can't believe Nora is missing out of this bomb ass pizza. Ooh, you swore. I know, right? You know, let me eat, bro. Stop talking, bro. Damn, I'm trying to eat. Bruh, can I finish my damn pizza? Damn, Harp, you actually eat the crust. What are you, Satan? It's kind of wasteful night not to. I guess. But you couldn't really eat the pill. It's not the same thing. Bruh. The pizza and the crust are the same thing. What is wrong with you? Ah, oh, bruh. Don't talk to me. Oh my god. Hey there. I ain't your friend. I saw you. I saw. I saw y'all pulling and driving that nice old truck. It ain't nice, bitch. It's about to break down. Are you just watching who pulls in and taking notes? Not at all, my friend. I just noticed you seem to be heading the same direction I was. How you know? How you know I didn't just want some pizza and I'm going home? Y'all mind if I hitch a ride with you? Where you headed? Just heading where the road takes me. I'm a bit of a adventurer. Just hiking the trails and seeing the country. See, that's how serial killers get away with what they get away with, bro. Especially back in this time. I'm assuming it's the 80s. I don't know what fucking year it is. It sound like the 80s. It might be just the 90s. It definitely ain't no damn 2000s. Actually, when was when was GPS invented? It might be like early early 90s or late 90s. I don't fucking know. So what do you all say? Care to give this free spirit a, a ride down that snowy road? No. No, you kidding me? Have you seen the snow out there? You want me walking down the road in this freezing weather? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bruh. You the one who chose to be hitchhiking in the goddamn snow. What is your problem, bruh? Why are you hitchhiking? We're stranger danger, bruh. We don't do that shit where I'm from. We bust caps and strange. Oh, I'm sorry. Wrong person. <laughs> you ain't too kind, are you? Hell no. Nah. Weird ass. You obviously just talked to like several different people, right? You about to slash her ties, bro. You better... Bro, you look weird as shit. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, that was weird. <laughs> oh, man. He didn't even order anything. Can you, like, let me finish my food before you start talking again, bro? My hungry ass. I really got big back energy right now eating this pizza. I wonder who I wonder who did the sounds for this shit, bro. Uh, my fault. That's not lately like of me. I'm sorry, y'all. Uh, my bad again. What? What? You 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 turned off now? Good. Uh. 
Holy, that was good. All right, then. Are you ready to hit the road? Maybe we can beat the worst of the snow. Give me the keys. Give me the keys. Harp, the weather is awful. Why don't you drive part of the way home? Bitch. I'm going. <clears throat> I'm going to drive so you can get a break. I'm afraid of what kind of break you're going to give, huh? Oh, my mind's in the gutter, bro. Can you like move over just a little bit, bro? My man's just trying to trying to do whatever the hell he's trying to do, bro. You'll be afraid if you didn't give me the keys. Fine, but there's one condition. What is it? I get first choice of bedrooms when or if we get there. I mean, whatever is what I actually said. My man's is huffing, Ooh. huffing, bruh. I remember y'all faces. If any of y'all show up at the damn cabin that we're going to, I will shoot on side. Taking inventory, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> About to say, is it okay? Oh, shit. I'm actually driving. Oh, yeah, we about to crash for sure. Bringing you the best tunes to warm your hearts on this chilly night as we embrace the first snowfall of the season. With the horn button, bro, I need to know. Like a perfect song to set the mood. So here's a track that'll make you feel right at home. Coming up next, be sincere. Oh, shit. And We're sliding. My fault. Oh. You a little too close, buddy. Hey, he was doing songs in the other one. Who got his name? I think it was like Neff or Neff or something like that. Bro, which way? Oh. Does that say right Woodbury? It does say. Oh, why is there would be on? Okay. Guess we're going this way. Oh, it's a cop. I should have ran into him so he gets on my radar and then follows us home. Bro, you don't want to talk now? I'm fucking up your clutch, bitch. <laughs> uh, my fault. <laughs> Where we going? You heard that? Is that me? Step into my with bloody lips saying that she loved me but never really did maybe i should go walk hey, over bro. the mountains find a new home away from where the town is i could spend a year alone jesus sets free soul. i could try my hardest and i'll never reach something about lust i know that i don't need love where, where are we heart. going bro didn't want to change, you gonna give me directions or some I shit it, it's a good time to start woodbury vermont Oh. And also, you said you got a GPS. Where is it? Stop sign, bro. Chill out. Why does it say get out? Are we here? Bro, tell me where we're going. I, dro I drove past our cabin at first. Hold on, bro. Hold on. I will never know. 
Hold on, bro. Where's a good girl? Doesn't wear a mask. Something wrong with your clutch, bro. It doesn't go in the gear that well. Always got my back. I need time from the hills and the monsters. I'm assuming that's it right there. What the hell's going on, bro? Your shit. Your shit stuck in neutral. For the day, even thoughts bring me I could spend a year alone and never miss a soul. And this should be I it. Why you didn't say that when I passed it up, bro? Goals. I know that I'm weak. I thought you were just gonna keep driving there. I did. Why you didn't tell me to stop? Hey, bro. You're a little depressed, huh? It's all good. It, it was very. It was quaint little house. Okay, you, you're going too fast, man. That's your bags? Alright. Slide to open. Oh shit. Uh let them know you're here. Oh, five one seven six. Easy. Case. I got the case. Get in there, bitch. What a great place. I knew we could count on you. It smells. It smells so nice in here. Right. But I really need to hit the John. Why you didn't? Take your time, Mike. While I'm going, can you put these groceries away? Should be enough space in the fridge. How you know? What if there's heads in there? I got it. The house was cozy and well furnished. Where the hell are his bags? And why the music so tense? I should tell the dude that we're here, huh? Hold on. Two cards of milk. 100% natural. That don't make no damn sense. It's like a bag of damn lemons, a carton of eggs, some tomatoes, some bell peppers, some lettuce. Bro, one, one container for, bruh. What the hell kind of food you was planning on making? Shouldn't even. You gonna explain what the hell you was planning on cooking? Whew! Sorry about that, Hart. Are you okay? Long drive and all that pizza really did a number on me. I hope you sprayed the shit out of that shit. Hang on. I ain't peeing yet. Well, all the groceries are put away. Thanks for handling that, Hart. Anyway, this place looks crazy nice. It's got that rustic charm you just don't see anymore. It's nice to get away from the city for a bit. For sure. Hey, I really need to pee now. I'll be back. You can go ahead. I'll start unpacking our bags. Thanks. Our bags? Bitch, I'm the only one who bought a brag. You better not sniff my panties. Let me look around first. Oh, a damn. Okay. Cross. What the fuck? How many damn doors did you go through? I don't like the fact that you went through several doors. All right, bro. I'm about to get jump scared like a motherfucker. Y'all, there's there's footsteps in the snow leading to the back. Y'all, hey, bro. When y'all go to an Airbnb, let me know, bro. Do y'all check? Do y'all check to make sure that that shit's straight before you actually start putting shit up, bro? Because if you don't, you need to. 
Uh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, this muff. I'm nice. Why are y'all watching me pee? Wash your hands and go. I didn't hear Mike wash his hands. Hold on. Just rush out. I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready for anything right now. You feeling better after the drive? I'm good. Want to check out the house? Sounds good to me. Let's see what this place has to offer. After you. <sighs> Motherfucker said ladies first, huh? All right, bro. This living room is bigger than my apartment. Damn. Sad. I felt that, though. You know what? It's for comfort, all right? And, and, and also... It's doing her good. Good rapport in the office is essential for achieving good The hell is that? And it's proven that employees who get along with Who the hell is that? Together. Tomorrow you'll be the happiest Hey bro, you got to turn that shit around. Creepy we'll ass. We're going to be one big family mark. Uh Why do you need this tiny ass shit? What would you do here? Oh hell no! Nah. Y'all motherfuckers crazy, bro. Y'all motherfuckers crazy. Come on, come on. Get back in the damn house, bro. We ain't, we ain't. If y'all say some shit about touching an Ouija board, bro, in this goddamn game, I'm cutting it off. We don't mess with spirits in somebody else's home. Can't, you ain't cooking shit with what you brought, bro. You ain't even bring no protein. Well, he did bring eggs, but you you, you brought, bro. You brought some. You brought some weird shit. When did you? When did you start cooking? I'm full of surprises. Don't wink at me. Hey, bro. Let's go walk outside, bro. Cause y'all, we got some shit. We got some shit to worry about. And desperately need oh hell no! Nah. Is your nine to five? What was that shit, bro? We don't we don't deal with basements, bro. I played too many damn games in this damn series where shit goes wrong in the basement, a Ouija board, the goddamn backyard, the fucking hitchhikers, bro. Hey, bro. I need you to listen to me, bro. What is wrong with your damn? I, uh, we ain't shaming nobody. Let's go out. Let's go outside. Check the back, bro. Come on now. Why we got why we got footsteps in the in the snow? It's getting it's getting really cold. It is, bro. It's called snow. Hey, bro, go check that shit out, bro. I've been scared by shit in cabins, bro. Oh, and the sounds picking up. Why the hell y'all got a basketball court goal? Brace yourselves. Brace yourselves. We just gotta we just gotta know what's going on. This guy's really must like fishing. It it can be fun. Oh yeah, there is a Okay. Forgot about that. Why you close the door? We just gotta make sure that there's no bodies hiding in here or some shit, you know what I'm saying? Dude's got rations. Are these rations or Yeah, it's rations. Alright. Uh Ah. Uh. Okay. I hope I don't have to remember this anytime soon. I'm just gonna act like I don't need that. Why did the music get creepy, bro? Oh, okay. 
So he's got his own fishing pond. Okay. All right. This ain't that bad. It's been a while since I went fishing, actually. Me too. You know what, bro? It's a little cold. Let's uh, let's let's not do this right now. We just had to just had to make sure that the shit was was kosher. You know what I'm saying? Not too many damn blind spots, bro. We got too many blind spots. We're going to have to check the basement, bro. All right. We're going to have to check the basement because I, I can't have nobody. I can't have nobody hiding in this bitch. Why? Why are there never a light switch? Why is there never a light switch for the damn basement? Imagine he he like, OK, bro. All right, I'm good, bro. I'm good, bro. Come on. You know what? You move it too slow. <laughs> I let my party job. Bro, where my room at? Storage. What the? F Did you not look in the damn rooms? Oh, hey, you're here. You scared us. Oopsie daisy, I didn't mean to. Why are you here? Hold on. The host is not supposed to be in the damn house when I show up, sir. What a lovely young couple. No, no, no. We're not a couple. <laughs> you didn't have to sell it that hard, hard bitch. Were you expecting me to say something else? I was just answering the question. He didn't ask a question, Sydney. He made a statement. And you, bruh, is you like offended? The hell's wrong with you? Oopsie daisy, silly me. Didn't mean to cause you a stir with you two. We didn't expect anyone to be here. And this motherfucker was just upstairs and he didn't breach and clear, bro. What's wrong with this man? See, this is why we're not dating. Because he don't breach and clear. See, I breach and clear. Oh, uh... I was out looking for my cat earlier and I remembered the TV has been on the fritz here. I was just watching the TV. Just thought I'd stop by and try to get it working again since the last few folks left a bad word for it. <laughs> I don't know why I told that. <laughs> you know, they saw say treat your your guests like family. My my family doesn't go without TV. It's about to be a long gameplay. Speaking of that, now that your folks are here, let me show you around my sweet home, bitch. We already just did that. Right now, I'd be a bad owner if I didn't give you the grand tour. He's got, he's got like dementia, Alzheimer's, some shit like that. <laughs> Middle-aged? Why does his face look familiar? Why are you showing me the toilet? You're not middle-aged? I'm sorry. <laughs> Here's your shower. That thing will make you feel like you're bathing under a, a waterfall in the Amazon jungle. <laughs> oh, this sink doesn't work, unfortunately. <clears throat> Not to worry. I I get fixed for you so real soon. Let me show you your, the other bedroom now.
What do you insinuate? Look, Harp, this room has a nice ass view. <laughs> you, you think that's nice, mister? <laughs> Wait till you show. Oh, I, <laughs> mm. I thought he was saying something else. Follow me now, please. Middle aged, huh? Bro, where did you put the bags? I'm mad confused. Oh, hell no. All right. Holy smokes! This is incredible. Sorry. It's incredibly cold. Glad your folks like it. This is one of my favorite spots. The view of, of the creek is beautiful. It's great spot for fishing too. All right, folks, let's head back to in before I catch the cold here again. Me first, bitch. <laughs> What the hell? Here's the st storage room. If you need anything, tools, extra blankets, whatnot, it's all in here. If the power, ah, uh, a heart, my heart, <clears throat> my fault. If the power ever goes out, you can all use this flashlight here on my right. Storms like these, you never know. We might. Thanks. I'm gonna just say thanks. I don't want to jinx it. <clears throat> All right, folks, let's head downstairs now. My old middle-aged knees. My man's hair is white as that snow outside, and y'all call him middle-aged. Well, man must be immortal. Uh, All righty, folks, I see you already stocked up the fridge with some tasty food. You see the knob? Turn the knob up for more cooling and down to cool it all. I tend to keep it low. In the winter, the bill gets out of control. Speaking of the winter, I better show you folks the water heater. He's starting to get like his 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 brain back. You know? It's like, oh hell no, he's taking us to the basement, bro. You better you better you better not go down there. Are you, are you coming, miss? Bitch, I'm afraid of the dark. Why are you looking like that? What's wrong with your neck? Why is the switch down here? The motherfuckers would never be good in, in a paranormal activity. Um, Nothing to worry about down here. Just the water heater and some old storage stuff. Now I'm worried. If it ever stops working, just hit the button at the bottom. The pilot light will fire right up and you'll be back in business. He doesn't do well in the dark time, so he's like having an issue with like speaking in the dark. Are, are you coming, miss? Bro, why is you like rushing me? What's over here, bro? Hey, sir, what's the deal with that? Why couldn't I ask that? Nothing you two need to concern yourselves with. Well, that's mad weird, sir. I kind of use this basement as storage. Renters don't need the space. They really ought to keep upstairs. Okay, well, I was just curious. Let's move on. No access to get. Bro, this is weird, bro. This is weird. What's back there, bro? What's back there? Oh, da 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 me. D did I mention? Well, no. Maybe I ought to keep it to myself. Well, bitch, spit it out. 
And the fella I bought this house from, well, told me he, his mother died down here. So, some guests have reported hearing the voice. Oh, fuck, it's paranormal. No. That's why y'all had a damn Ouija board. Why you got a damn Ouija board, man? Oh, I don't want to deal with ghosts today. And it's 10 p.m. <sighs> Some guests had said they could hear. <laughs> oh, man. No, I can't. I can't. Uh. That's the one thing they haven't done yet is paranormal shit, bro. Not, not to scare you folks, but if I were one of you, I wouldn't really step down here. <laughs> the, the looks on your face is <laughs> Come on now. I'm just joking. <laughs> My favorite meme. <laughs> Bro, that's some weird shit. All right, folks, snow's starting to pick up. I'm gonna hit the road now. Gotta find that damn cat. We offer thousands of cabins readily. Thanks for showing us around. The click of a button. Enjoy amazing views. And by the way, relaxation in our What was the name on the booking? Now, I'm must be getting old. Hell yeah. It's Sydney. Ha. Sit. That's right. We have a pretty name for a pretty lady. Pet friendly, alcohol friendly, family. Why'd you look at me like that? Ground, and many more. Is so is it just me or is that dude super weird? Very weird. Anyway, let's go see if there's a, anything good on the TV. Actually, I'm going to take. I'm going to go take a quick shower. Cool. I'll find something to watch while you're you're in there. Chuck. <laughs> let me let me know if you. Oh, okay. I'm just like every time he says some weird shit, I gotta I gotta like read it first before I say it because I don't want to be the one saying it. What a weird guy. Thanks. I ain't gonna lie, bro. They said that this game is is about two hours. I might be prolonging this with my commentary. You didn't even bring your clothes in here. I don't even know where he put the clothes. Um, I'm about to say, what if I just ran downstairs naked? You think you think Mike would uh would be okay with um? You think Mike would be okay with uh, seeing seeing my bare ass? The fuck? <laughs> hey, Harp, check this out. I found this fishing rod in that shed. Planning to catch dinner? Now that you've mentioned it, that that would be a pretty epic addition to the trip. I don't know. It's cold out there. Come on, Harp. What would make this trip more epic than catching our own freaking dinner? Didn't you did you not just eat pizza and then say that the pizza like fucked your stomach up right? and then like blow up the bathroom? Like there wasn't another lady in this house. Hell yeah. Follow me. There's another rod in the shed. Fuck! My fault. <laughs> Oh man, it's late, bruh. Do you want to grab the, uh, the the other fishing rod heart? Yeah, just give me a second, bitch. Oh snap, I saw a killer recipe for baked carp. Who said that you can make it? We'll, we'll, need, to, we'll need to catch three carp, though. Yes! Well, first things first, we need the, the, the right bait for the cart. Check out this bait information board. 
Whenever you are ready, grab a carp bait and let's head to the crack. Creek crack. We're going to catch some carp. Harp. Oh my god, you're corny as fuck. Let me grab the bait. Harp. What's up with my damn. I hope those carp are biting to today, tonight, you mean? Bruh, it's it's goddamn snowing, man. Who the hell fishes in the snow? Did I put the bait on? I don't think I put the bait on. Hold on. This motherfucker. Is the bait on there? I guess it is, huh? Oh shit, wait. Oh, I'm doing this right. I don't know if I am. Goddamn mini game. Blue Gill, this ain't cart. Look it. Keep that shit, fuck it. Alright. But like you could also eat that, you know. Just just letting you know. Twenty-four hours later. Oh my fucking god, about damn time, bruh. Jesus. Oh, no thanks to you. <laughs> my fault. Let's go. While I'm while I'm cleaning the fish, do you mind prepping the murmur murmur nate? Sure. Just take a bowl and throw it in ginger paste, cooking oil, black pepper. You ain't bring none of that shit, bro, except for that damn yogurt. Why is this shit still open? Hey, bro, your shit about to be all over the place. Say peppers. Black pepper. Bro, you didn't bring none of the shit on this damn list. Salt. Pep. That shit look like ass. Do you mind throwing the fish in the marinade in the casserole uh, while you chop these veg veggies? Sure. on the ground. Where the fish at? Oh. Can't do more than one fish. Pick it up! Why, why only two? Why did we catch three carp if you're only cooking two? I get it. You're probably waiting on Nora. Wouldn't you want to have it ready? I read. <laughs> I'm done with the voices. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Those carps are going to taste out. You ain't going to. Just... While we wait for it to cook, how about we play the fuck game? I swear to God, if you say a Ouija board, bro, I'm gonna fucking. I'm gonna. I'm gonna close the shit. Bro, I'm not touching no damn Ouija board. Which one? Just grab whatever catches your eye. K 
can't wait to see what you pick. I, I saw some in the living room next to the living room. <laughs> Why the fuck is this open? <laughs> I thought I closed it. Oh. What did he say? Living room next to the living room, right? Hey, bro. I, I feel like if I cut this TV on. There's probably like a camera to that room that we can't get into. Snakes and ladders. Did that Ouija board come back? All right, good. Because that would have been crazy. Um, Whispers in the dark. Jenga. Hey, bro. Star Titan Force. Let's go. Let's get, get, get. You won the game, bro. That's a classic. But how about we go for something with a bit of motherfucker? You asked me to pick a shit, and I picked the shit, bro. Piece of shit. If this motherfucker says, "I want to, I want to talk to ghosts," I'm gonna, I'm gonna smack him in the face. How's this, sir? What are you talking about? Stop being stingy. I'm not getting no damn Ouija board, bitch. Snakes and ladders gets the blood pumping from me, bruh. Hey, bruh. Monopoly gets the blood pumping from me. Jenga gets the blood pumping from me. I'm tired of you, bruh. I'm bringing you everything but that shitty ass. Y'all pissing me off. Y'all pissing me off, bruh. Y'all pissing me off, bruh. I'm going to end your goddamn worthless life. I refuse to act like I I I, I ain't talking to no damn ghost, bruh. Stop saying that. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you want to play Jenga? Uh, totally, it's been a long time for me, too. Oh, my God, bro. Are you serious? This motherfucker just had me pick 30 different games. But Jenga's the one you want. Not the other one. Jenga. You want to play Jenga? It's actually Jenga. What the fuck is this? Draw the loop. Now why the hell I gotta do that? What the fuck? Why didn't that work the first time? Bruh, it's the second move. What the hell are you talking about? What the fuck? What is this? The Squid Games? This game gonna be longer than two hours for me. Hell no. Nah. the damn star oh my god wait why'd you go twice why are you going again what's going on why did he just go three times why did he go three times what the fuck Oh, 
the music change? Why the fucking music change? Why you left the letters on the floor? Why are you picking it with your bare hands? Shit look burnt. Look at that noise. I think our show is about to come on. What? Who's our, our show? Our show. Bro, why are we not cooking for Nora? Where you at, bitch? Biggest chocolate cake with a spoonful of mayonnaise. Is that Berlizzi? Delicacy is very popular in Romania. That's gotta be Berlizzi. Flows down the rivers like a mayonnaise water park. So for this shit look, uh, this shit look, why am I not eating? Asparagus. Eat it. Oh, there it is. Season these with a lot of salt. Salt is good for the bones. After letting these simmer in the salt bath, we can start <laughs> making the chocolate. Bruh, we'll take a couple Berlizzi, of you can't hide beans. your voice from no one. Ah, uh, yes, the cocoa beans need to be blended into the sauce with a little bit of vinegar. You gotta keep that fancy flavor <laughs> in there. The next thing we prepare is the mayonnaise. That was some damn fine we food. Twice as good since we caught the fish ourselves. Tofu. It was all right. Gonna lie. You don't have to rain on my parade my heart. Shit. It was no Mo's pizza, but, but I thought it turned are. out well. Anyway, I'd rather pizza. Anyways, this is the green of the mayonnaise. I need to check my emails real we, we quick. Left my laptop upstairs. A little anesthesia to make Thought sure we were taking a break from work. It's not it work. I'm just waiting on shipment details for my new, uh, new, new DS. Like Nintendo? Nintendo? And place it inside the oven. Okay, and while that's cooking, we can start. Oh, we got a Nintendo on DS on the way. Gasoline soaked ramen. Now this dish is extremely hard to make. A dish only for experienced cooks. It requires a lot of patience. Tell me some skill. What you will need is gasoline mm -hmm. and ramen. Oh my god! This dish really soothes the soul. Almost like a cayenne cleanse. Okay. We begin by pouring the gasoline into this pot. Make sure not to use whole gasoline since it's really bad for you. <laughs> Maybe use 2% or Six. half and half. Motherfucker said half and half gas. <laughs> After letting the gasoline come to a point, we put in our ramen. I'm using some stuff I found in my grandmama. Shout out Berlizzi. But it's so fat. Am is almost eleven o'clock. Should stop saying the time, bro. Y'all gonna y'all gonna dodge me. Actually, kind of scientific. Bill Nye, who the gasoline molecules merge with the noodle molecules, and they taste very good. Now that I think there's someone under my bed right now. Can you come upstairs? Why'd you spell stairs like that? Bro, if you don't handle that shit, bro. With the fire extinguisher. Well, damn. Uh, uh, damn, that's burnt. You said someone under my bed. What the fuck do you mean walk slow? Which room are you in? Oh my god, these motherfuckers don't jump scare me. Oh my god. Like why? You're lucky I didn't break your nose. Hey, good looks are half my charm. Alright, have you seen your damn eyes? Sorry. Don't mess them up. I totally got you. Bro, this is some weird shit, bro. That was fun, wasn't it? It's not cool, you dumb but Come on, it was just a joke. No, it wasn't. You want to go for the next round? What the fuck are you talking about? Oh my god. Bruh. How, how old are you? 
Why are we playing hide and seek? You bored of shit? Damn. Not playing on damn grown ass man hide and seek, bro. This is fucking weird. This motherfucker's about to go to the goddamn basement, brother. Oh my god. What the fuck just happened to me? You counting yet? No! It's been 10 seconds, bro. I, I didn't count it for you, bro. This is some childish shit, bro. Why are we playing hide and go seek in this? Why y'all can't let me make black decisions, man? Including pet friendly. Why y'all can't let me make black decisions, bro? Why are we going to the basement? He said not to go down there. Only <sighs> Offer dirt cheap coverage for quality vehicles. You'll never find better prices. That motherfucker's gonna have me close my eyes down here, huh? No. Can I leave the basement first? This is childish. This is fucking childish, bro. I'm gonna have to cheat, bro. I'm sorry, bro. I can't. I can't deal with that damn loud ass music, bro.
upstairs. Sliding up here, you didn't hear it? No. There's an attic too? There's a basement in an attic. And we just gonna snoop around this shit, bruh. Yeah, I'm hopping in the truck and I'm leaving. Come on now. What? Are you, are you telling me to go up there? Why the fuck would I go? This is childish. This motherfucker, bro. Oh my god, this motherfucker wants a goddamn go into the damn attic now. We're going in the attic. What the fuck? Peace. Why the fuck you not being a man and doing this shit yourself? It's shit. <laughs> why, you, why you turn the light off? It's a goddamn cat. Oh my god. <laughs> Why'd y'all make that noise? How the hell did you get this in the attic? This fucking game, bro. <laughs> Woo. What do you mean by that, bitch? Oh, that's a relief. Or we can give her the damn blue guild that I keep getting. No. Why are we still playing this game? Where are you trying to? This motherfucker's in the basement, huh? This motherfucker's in the damn basement. Ah! What the fuck? Huh? 
Hey, why are you back again? I'm fixing the faucet. You got a problem with that? Should have told us. This is my house. I don't need to check in with every time. You kind of do, bro. That's just. You kind of do, bro. I've never seen anyone fix a faucet with a hammer before. You ever fixed many faucets yourself, young man? I'm not doing the voice. I'm stressed out. It didn't think so, so I imagine you don't know. <laughs> How long have you been here? Just got here a couple minutes ago. If you heard anything before that, it must have been that old lady, remember? You asking me to leave, miss? No, Rick. She's being polite. We rented this house and would like to have it to ourselves. I, but we don't really want to have to call law enforcement. Ain't no cops in Woodbury. So what the fuck? So the, the cop that I just saw on our way here, he was the last one leaving? What kind of bullshit? Oh my god. You know what? If you folks don't like me fixing the faucet, I'll leave you to it. After locking the door, we debated what to do. We agreed that there was something off about Rick from the start. It seemed like he enjoyed making excuses to come over unannounced. We also should have told him we found his cat. In the end, we decided Rick was weird, but probably harmless. We attributed his behavior to an extreme lack of social awareness. He was born in the 20s. Look, we already drove all, all the way out here. Let's just enjoy ourselves, Mike said. But by this time, I was feeling really tired. I decided to get some rest. Oh my god. Oh fuck. Another one of these dream nights. Hard to sleep when someone's knocking on the door. What the fuck? Are you? you weird, bro. You weird. Ah, uh, get off me! Get off me! Let's see the truck in the driveway. Hope Nora is okay. She'll be just fine, Sydney. Don't worry. I'm here to keep you safe. Hey, it's no problem at all. Guys are supposed to watch over. Why the fuck you didn't go in the attic? This motherfucker's about to... He's about to spill his heart and soul out to me. And I'm about to tear him down. Because he ain't no man to me. Sorry. What a day, huh? This wasn't exactly how I thought our getaway was going to go, Sydney. No right. It's been a strange day. Can you believe that guy? He just keeps wandering around the house like he owns the place. He does own the place. Yeah, I wish he would just cut it out. You know exactly what I meant. Sydney, he shouldn't just barge in this place whenever he wants. We rented the for damn house. I mean, the guy is probably harmless, but I'm frustrated. Me too. 
I really need to sleep now, Mike. It'll help if we both get some sleep. Bitch, get off my bed! <laughs> this is weird, bro. You're weird. You're weird. You're weird. Bro. Harp, you know. Let's just talk, and it's been too long. You know? You don't have to sleep alone at night if you want. If Valid question, Mike. Answer it. A trip to Oregon. I do remember. Really well. It didn't start out awkward, though. Mike, we had a lot to drink, bruh. They sure did. I'm hoping maybe they can happen again. Like, I don't know what to say. You just let me worry about the details, Sydney. Let me, let me check my phone. Guys, I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury and my stinking tire just blew out. It's snowing and I'm on the side of the road on Highway 11 near Killington. There's a sign by the side of the road. It's hard to see. I, I think it says Kent Pond. The snow is like half of a deep and I can't get the lug nuts off the tire. <laughs> I hate to ask, but can you two come get me? Who the fuck did this voice, bro? <laughs> I'm sorry, but that shit's annoying. Get up! It's facts. No, oh, Sydney, you stay here and get some sleep. No, I'm coming too! Bro, give me the option to go. I'm not staying in this damn house by myself. She, she said something that made sense. Why the fuck did you leave it open? What's wrong with you? Fuck the damn door. And barricade that fucking basement. I don't have a lock the door. Told myself things would get better if I could just get some rest. Nora always knew how to cheer me up, and I needed it more than, more by the minute. With her arriving soon, I decided to rest in the meantime. Oh great, an hour later.
Oh, you look, I can't fucking see. Bro, why you got these damn shits, bro, that I can't see through? Who the fuck? Oh my god, it's the fucking hiker. Ain't ideal to be banging on your door in the middle of the night, but I'm in a bad spot here. I was counting on a ride from some friends, but they are running behind and won't be here for about two more hours. Thanks, but I was hoping you'd let me wait inside until my friends get here to get me. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of would have let him in. Just for the simple fact that I know the threat is not him, it's something else. Okay, it might be him. Yeah, let me freeze to death out here. <laughs> Make you go hiking in a snowstorm. I should have known you'd, you'd be a, a big bitch. As big a bitch here as you. Wait, how do you know it's me? You think I didn't see you and your little boyfriend fishing in the creek earlier? I figured maybe you'd give me a chance this time, but looks like you're still unkind. Get out or I'll call the cops. Ain't no cops around. Oh my God. Speaking of, I don't see your fella's truck out here neither. I'm down that one one. Suit yourself. What does that mean, bro? Hey, you. Do you have a car? Do you have insurance? Do you have a dog? No. <laughs> <laughs> but let me tell you something. You'll get what's coming to you for leaving me out here. The fuck do you mean by that? Karma's a bitch. Goddamn Jojo Siwa. I don't fuck with this. At all. I ain't fucking with this at all. What year is it, bruh? How the hell did y'all live in this goddamn time? But now, what the fuck was that? The fuck was that? What the fuck is going on? Fuck that. This motherfucker throw a snowball at me? Not calling him. Text, text this dude too. for help does your phone not work oh bruh is there like a phone I gotta use I'm so confused
the hell's going on here? Oh, thank God you're here. Rick, I'm glad you came. Did you see anyone outside? Explain the situation. Yeah, I came as quickly as I could. Came kind of quick, bro. It sounds like you were just right down the street, bro. I wouldn't worry about him anymore. The fuck do you mean by that? <laughs> the fuck, he got a hammer in his hand. By the way, where's your friend? The guy who was with you earlier. Like he went to pick up my friend. Hmm. So you're all alone here right now, huh? About to run for it, bro. About to run for it. Are you exhausted and desperately? And the fucking right? lights on. Is your nine to five stressing you out? Take a vacation with rentacabin.com. We offer thousands of cabins readily available. Like this bring out all kinds of folks. Of Enjoy amazing views. Not all of and them know when to stay away. In our refurbished cabins. Now, not only are these cabins cheap, but they're also safe, with each cabin having a designated caretaker to ensure that your stay is top-notch. We have many options to choose from, including pet-friendly, alcohol-friendly, family-sized, underground, and many more. So if you need a vacation my friends, and want to visit rentacabin.com and enjoy this Is that so? Lifetime. Yeah, thanks for coming by, though. You can head back if I'll be fine, man. You sure about that? You sure about that? Yeah. So reacted. Maybe I should stick around and make sure everything's really okay. You need to leave right now. You are not Rick. Who are you? I don't want to agitate this man. What did you just say? Great. This man has a hammer in his hand, by the way. Are you exhausted and desperate? Is my fucking is beat is my five stressing you out? I told you he's got dementia, bro. I will leave when I want to. We offer thousands. You need to leave right now. Get out of get out of here before I call the cops. What do you want? Views and undisturbed relaxation in our refurbished I don't cabin. think so. Now, if anyone is leaving this house, cheap, but they're also safe with each cabin it will having be one. a designated what? caretaker to ensure that your stay is top notch. We have many options to choose from, including pet friendly, alcohol friendly, mm. family sized. What the fuck? I know what I gotta do. What the fuck? It ends? I know what I gotta do, y'all. I know exactly what I gotta do. It's the same as it's the same as the other games, man. They show you the hiding spots for a reason. And right now there's two hiding spots and one is closer. Unfortunately, it's the basement.
Why the fuck? I can't get out that way. Fuck. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Man. I should've went out the back door. I think. Oh, he fucking blocked it. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? People, oh my god. Oh, shit. Uh, uh, I don't know where to go now. I can run upstairs. That doesn't make any sense. That doesn't make any sense!
I didn't want to talk while I was in the attic, bro. I just, I just didn't want to risk it. <laughs> I told him everything that happened after Mike Lad left. Ricky called the cops. The storm had quieted down by the time we they arrived, and of course, the man was nowhere to be seen. Huh? I didn't know if I was supposed to just wait it out in the attic or not, but I, bro, <laughs> when I drive back, the whole night played over and over in my head. We think that the man we saw secretly lived in that cabin when it wasn't being used and planned on robbing us during our stay. But cops seem to think there was more intent behind this man's actions aside from just robbing us. Rig asked me what the man looked like, and after that, he didn't ask any more questions. We think he knew more than he was letting on, but in the end, he gave us all, he gave us a refund, full refund. He better. We need more conversation than that, bro. I'm gonna need a refund plus some. I'm Dante's in here. All right, well that's gonna be it's gonna be it, man, for episode five, bro. I, I'm not gonna lie, I actually I actually did think that there was gonna be some paranormal shit that would happen. I'm kind of curious if I did leave the uh, Ouija board in the house and picked it up, would that have been an interesting thing, interesting side thing to do? Um, and considering that it's not paranormal. Uh, I'm wondering if it, there just would have been a funny joke behind it or some shit, but uh, let me know what y'all think, man. Can I, I? I know that there's like a story that this is based off of, but why the hell did she not text nobody while she was hiding, bruh? At least she's got like haptic tones on and it's shit's loud as fuck. I don't know, bruh. But she could have texted somebody. I'm, I'm trapped. I'm trapped in the attic. You know? There's a man in here. Call the cops. Also, I guess her phone doesn't call cops. She doesn't have an emergency phone, uh, emergency line on her phone. She can only text, which is funny. But that's it for this video. Uh, my heart hurts. Um, it's been a minute since I've played a scary game, and. I think it's going to be another minute before I play another one. <laughs> uh, but if y'all enjoyed the video, let me know. You know how to do that. Like button. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know what y'all want to see next, bro. But that's going to be it for me, man. I will see y'all next video.